Hey Leo, what's up? How y'all doing? Remember that this could resonate to you, um, your person or a third party. So let's see what's going on with Leo. My dogs are out of control today. What is the overall message between Leo and their person? What is the overall message between Leo and their person? Okay. What is your body message to me? Leo, I feel like you're closing up a cycle for some reason. You're telling me that's a good thing. What is the overall energy between Leo and the person? Oh my God, they're stuck. What is the overall? Why? Oh my God. There it goes. The five of swords. A lot of swords are coming out today. Look at this. You had a big. The Knight of Swords. Something's going to move fast. Something moved fast. Something happened. This is flying out. Hold on. Okay, somebody that you were with, that you made an offer to, or made you, they made an offer to you, something happened here. Or you moved too quickly, or they moved too quickly, and a whole, like a little problem happened here. Or they feel like it's too quick, you're moving too quick, or they're moving too quick. But I feel like, I don't know, I feel like you feel like it's moving too quick. The offer they gave you. You feel like it's moving too quick. You didn't take it. Because the this came in reverse. And there's an offer. It could be a job. It could be a promotion. It could be, you know, it could be anything. A past, um, an ex, or the person you're dealing with. But I feel like it's, it's not the person you're dealing with right now. It could be an ex. Or it could be a job offer and you didn't take it. You just didn't want to take it. So take how that, how that resonates, okay? What is happening right now with... Um, Leo and their person. Damn. The four cups. Things are moving slow. But you're having a good time, Leo. You're having a good time. They're telling me. You're having a good time. You are just doing you. And I see like, oh, damn. They're just flying out on you. Could be dealing with a Capricorn, you know. I'm not, I already said it, I ain't even trying to say anything. The four swords, you've been thinking a lot, and this is for your person right here. Like, you having a good time, Leo? You're doing you, you're doing you, Leo. You've been having your little drinks here and there. You might be chilling with a Capricorn, a friend that's a Capricorn, you know, somebody that you like, somebody that you're trying to manifest. That's a Capricorn, but you've been doing a lot of thinking. You've been doing a lot of thinking, um, Leo. A lot of thinking. You've been dreaming a lot. This person might be a person that you cut off. You're having a good time doing you. You think a lot about this person. 
because like, you know what you've been thinking a lot about this person they just told me they just corrected me you had a lot of fallout with this person and you've been thinking a lot about this person and you do think a lot about this person you care for this person a lot but you just want to do you now you want to do you now and you feel like a kid again. For some reason, they're telling me you feel like a kid again. You're, you're having fun. Like if you were a teenager in your teenage years, is what they're telling me. Like you having fun, like if you're in your teenage years or in your early 20s, you know, late 20s, when everybody's chilling and having fun. And you could be doing it with somebody that you like, is what I'm hearing. So this person, you know, could be a person that could be significant for you. But this person's afraid. This could be a friend of yours that you're trying to manifest to be in your life. Or they're trying to manifest you. But they're afraid. Because they've been through a lot of problems too. With relationships. Both of you have. So there's a person coming into your life. While you're having this problem. That has had problems with relationships before. Or had a problem. And you're both probably just leaning on each other. You feel me? And you're acting like kids. You're going out, you're having a little drinks here and there. You feel like a kid again, is what they're telling me. You're probably doing it with this person. Okay? Or you might have gone and have a drink with this person. But what I'm my the energy that I'm picking up here is you got another person that you've been chilling with. Or you're trying to chill with, you haven't chilled with yet, had a couple of drinks, had a dinner, had something like that. And this person and you are relying on each other. You're, you know, you're talking to each other about the things that have happened to you. And you're going to end up with this person. For, for the ones that, are, that this is going to resonate to you, you're going to end up with this person. They already told me. Hold on. Yeah. They're going to offer you something. Love, a long time commitment, friendship. I don't know, but I feel like it's love. And it's going to be from the heart. Or it's already happening. You feel good around this person. Or this person that's going to come in, you're going to feel real good about this, with this person. Because they, they, they're from the heart. They talk from the heart. They do things from the heart. They said, you might know this person for a long time is what I'm picking up. You know this person from a long time. You might have been close friends and known each other for years. And you just like caught up again after so many years. Is what I'm picking up. Because I see childhood here too. You might know this person from childhood. Or since you were very young. Okay? So take how that resonates, okay? Let me give you a card. Um, They're just popping out. What the hell? Okay, so this is like, you know, a little um message from the universe, the spirits. Let's see what it says. Okay, two came out. It says cautious, a wise action, meticulous attention to detail, kindness to others. Okay. It says powerful intuitive epines. Wait a minute. Epiphanies. Oh my God, I can never say that word. Whatever. Letting go of worry and fear. Understanding the truth of a situation. Okay? So you've been thinking a lot. Okay? Just understand the truth and understand everything that's going on and think clearly is what it's trying to tell you. Think very clearly. There's somebody here. I've been having, um... I've been having, um... People that have passed away come in and there's somebody here it's an older lady I feel like it's somebody's mom saying to please do the right thing they see you suffering a lot and they're good where they're at but they don't like to see you suffer Leo and I feel like it's a mother of somebody because she kind of has me like like if I want to cry I'm sorry, but I was going to do this next week, but this is coming out now. I feel like she's, um, 
It doesn't make to see you suffer. Do the right thing, she's saying. You know, follow your thoughts. And if you have any thoughts in your head that are not light, that they're darkness, she wants you to think of her when you're having these thoughts. I feel like crying. I'm sorry. She's very close to me. She says, think about her. I remember how she was in life. That you don't want to go through what she did. She suffered a lot. Is what I'm picking up. But she's okay now. She's in the spirit world. And she feels she's okay. She's with her loved ones. She feels like you need to like settle your life down. That's what she's saying to me. To tell you. Settle down. She wants to see you happy. You deserve it. I'm sorry. Like my, I'm tearing because she's. I don't know if this is going to resonate too, but she came in crying. I'm so sorry. Light and prosperity for the spirit. She's okay. I'm just tearing because she's tearing because she came in. Um, I have a lot of um, spirit connections, so she came in to give this connection because I was going to do these readings next week, but for some reason they all came in today. So whoever's mom this is, She's okay. She just wants you to be happy and want you to make the right decisions. She suffered a lot of life, she says. And she doesn't, want, she doesn't want to see you suffer the same way she did. The rest of your life, do it. Be happy. Do what makes you happy. Okay, and if somebody doesn't make you happy, let it go and find happiness. Okay? For the most part, she's okay. I feel like she's try she's crying more for joy at the same time because she was able to come in here and give a message because there's been some readings where some messages have been coming in. So take out take that out. She can't even talk. I feel like when she passed away she couldn't talk. There, there was no way of her talking. She couldn't speak. So when I yeah, she couldn't speak. When she was passing away, so she couldn't tell you nothing. I'm sorry for whoever this is. Light and prosperity for that um spirit. I will give her another candle when I shut this down. I'm even shaking. Somebody might have been shaking, or she might have been shaking at the moment of her passing. Okay, but for the most part, she's okay. She's just she wants to see you happy. She is happy, but she wants to see you happy. Okay? And there's a mother speaking to a son or a daughter. Okay? Love and light for this um, spirit that just came through. Let me see if there's anything else from the spirit. I feel like um, she died out of a sudden. It was not expected, but it was her time to go. She served her purpose in life. She's with her family, she says. Angel of good news. Wow. You're going to receive some good news. Angel of good news. I don't know if you get on boats a lot or you're trying to buy a boat or a yacht or something like that or you're just trying to manifest a business in the boat business but it's going to be good news for you angel of good news she's going to help you with that okay she's going to help you with that try to go to the um for some reason a lot of money's coming in you're going to have a lot of money coming in. For whatever you're trying to manifest here, the good news is money. It could be that the business went through. It could be that you, the business is going to go good. Or you're trying to open a business. It's going to go good and it's going to make you a lot of money. So whoever's trying to do this, go for it. It's going to make you a lot of money. And if you're thinking about it, don't think about it no more and do it. Because you're thinking. This, this 
mother that's coming in here is going to make it happen, okay? And you're going to receive good news, okay? Let me give you a love oracle for you and your person. Wow. She's okay. She's calm. Very calm lady. She's a very calm and loving lady. And helped everyone. And accepted everyone. No matter what. Is what she's telling me. I accepted everybody no matter what. I feel like she knew a little bit of English, but not much. But she speaked it a little bit. She understood. You entiendo, she's telling me. She understands. Okay, so two of these came out. It says, manifesting miracles. Your dream is soon to become reality. Trust your heart and continue to follow its guidance. You see what I'm saying? Your dream is about to come true. Whatever it is that you are manifesting business, love, whatever it is, I feel like it's this business. It's going to come. It's going to happen. You're going to be good. Follow your dreams. Forgiveness. Stop focusing your energy on past events for life is too precious to waste. You create your reality by what you think. Dream and imagine. Okay, so leave the past behind you is no good and continue with your life. You know what to do. I don't got to tell you. My beautiful Leos, I wish you the best, and I'll see you later.